Minasan konnichiwa, it's me, your girl Erica, here with. It's not even going to your face. And with Ashley. <laughs> oh, it's it's dark. Oh. I think we'll just have to do the intro later. Anyway, so today we are shopping at Ulta. This is so hard to film with on this. We're at Ulta. <laughs> we're, we're at Ulta. Okay, it does not want to go. <laughs> I, I don't get how she films with this. This thing keeps losing my face. Okay, Ashley, here. So, oh, lost my face again. This this camera sucks. I'm never using this again. Mom, I hate that you recommended me to use this. Anyways, so we're gonna go shopping. Okay, there we go. This way, I don't have to worry about anything. <laughs> Don't need it. Okay, I'm gonna get distracted so fast. You gotta, you gotta keep me up target. I'll get so distracted. Okay. Too Faced concealer. Is this it? Okay. So this is the concealer. This one. This top one. It looks like foundation, but it's concealer. So this one's really highly recommended. Now I gotta find my shade. <sighs> okay. So we got the foundation with the concealer I'm dripping with foundation and then now we're looking at the gloss by Fenty Beauty and I'm looking at this color by Fenty Beauty it's called sweet mouth I'm gonna try this color too it's called fussy <laughs> yes no habla japonés. Japonés. Boom. Okay, so this is a little more pink than I did last time. I don't know I like this dark pink. Yeah. I don't know which one's better. I like that one more. You like this one more? Really? <laughs> I feel like the other one, I, I like get if it's like, you, you can't really tell like much of a difference, but I feel like it did nothing. It just made it look shiny. But also I think it's because I put a lot more of this one on than the other, so maybe I'll just do half the other with this color, and then half the other. Okay. That way you can see. So Ashley has a friend who, who had an Ariana Grande perfume sample, and Ashley doesn't know the name of it, so now she's trying to find... Hers are so sweet. Yeah, use a new strip though, cause you're you're not gonna be able to tell the difference. <laughs> Love that, yummy yum. That one's really sweet too. It might be one of the ones that look more like a crystal, Ashley. I think you're going for the wrong ones. Oh my god. Go for the ones that kind of look like crystals down here. I do. Both of them? Yeah, I mean I didn't go for that one. Or this one? Oh, that's Prada. Never mind. <laughs> Oof, these are sweet. I can smell them. Oh my god. That one's just too... Let me try this one again. They have Juicy Couture. None of these? No, it might not be. But, did you try this? No. I'm taking all the shoes. Yes, take all of them, actually. Could it be this one possibly? I mean, they don't have the perfume version of it, but like, this like God is a woman scent? Nope. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're looking for the silk thing. I don't know where it is. Oh, it's right there. No, this isn't it. This is like a mix of them. There's one. Oh. I don't need 10 of them. I don't know if it's focused. <laughs> so, so the items. So we, we waited 20 minutes for someone to find this because apparently it was in the back, all the way on the top of the shelf. But we got it. So now we're just going to check out. 
Oh, you wanna- let's show them the- the little lip balms that we found. But... Look at these cute little lip balms. If I actually used a lip balm, I would've got one for her, but she doesn't use lip balm. Jesus! How do people wear those? I don't know. Oh, is this how people do this? Where, like, it's, like, patchy? Uh, yeah. Some people do it that way. I don't do that, because that's annoying. That's too much effort. But we're gonna check out, and we will talk to you guys after we are out the store. First things up is the Satin Heatless Curling Set. Now, this is basically... So, I actually do naturally have a little bit of a wavy hair. I don't have, like, curls, but I have waves. Um, and I've been very curious to, like, figure out how to do this without having to use heat every day on my hair because it damages your hair a lot. So, I got this. It is basically like this silk band that you put over your head and you wrap your hair around, leave it overnight or a few hours, take it out and you have curls. So I'll be testing this out another day. I'm very curious about this for sure. <clears throat> so then we're gonna go into some of the other products that I got. So let's start with foundation stuff, I guess. So first things first, I have the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. Um, blurring skin tint ease drop. This is uh, a product I read online that is really good on TikTok. They said this is a really good tint. And I also heard there's like a trick if you mix a tint and your foundation together, you get this really flawless skin look that I really want to test out. So next up, we are gonna go to concealer, which this was another recommendation that I saw from TikTok, which is the Too Faced Born This Way. I was using the NARS Creamy Concealer, which I loved. I love that concealer, it's beautiful. It's very flawless looking. The only thing is it's really small, so you're paying $30 for a product that's gonna last you like a month or two. So this is the concealer, it's actually pretty big, like, the skin tint and the concealer. So they're just, it's a very big concealer, but yeah. Anyway, so next I bought the Fenty, the Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss. This is the Glow Balm Universal Lip Luminizer. So this is what the packaging looks like, and this is in the shade Sweet Mouth. This is a very cute shade. It's a very neutral shade. I did try this on in the store. I did take a video of it, but it's not a really good video. I was between this one and a little bit of a darker one named uh, Fussy, but I end up deciding on this cute. There it is, Fenty Beauty. And this is the lip gloss, and it's so cute. Like gloss, but I have a really hard time with gloss because sometimes it's really sticky. Um, this one was recommended also on TikTok for not being super sticky. And also the shade was really pretty, it's a little shimmery, but it's not crazy pigmented, which I love because I have a problem with using lips that are really colored. I just don't, I don't know, I just don't like the way it looks on my lips. So yeah, I got this. And to match with the Fenty lip gloss, I got a lip liner, which I thought I only picked up one of these, but I guess I picked up two. So next up, we have the MAC Prep In Prime Fix Spray, Fix Plus Spray. This is typically what you'll see people use um, for setting spray. I have heard a lot about the spray that I currently use. It's not really a setting spray. It's more of like a, if you have really caking makeup, that's what you use to um, moisten it. So it's not as powdery or cakey. This is more for actually like setting your makeup in place. But this is the one that everyone uses, the one I see a lot of people use. Um, but yeah, I've never used it. It's from MAC Cosmetics, which is pretty common. I've seen it in Japan as well. But this is the product itself. And this product is $30, I believe. Just because Ulta has a 21 days of beauty. And they, uh, today, 
they were discounting these two items for 50% off and I couldn't really turn it down because they were like a really good deal and products that I just wanted to try out anyways so I bought them <laughs> with my own money but um yeah so first we have the Kopari Kopari I think I don't know how to pronounce this but it is the ultra restore body butter with high high hyaluronic acid which is good for like if you have uneven skin tone or hyperpigmentation so which I have quite a bit of on my legs so this is what it looks like it has coconut oil it smells very coconutty oh my god and it looks like that you can see it but yeah it was really highly reviewed and it was discounted to like 17 bucks after discount it's normally like through this actually might have been the more expensive one hold on oh so this one's normally 32 dollars and it was discounted to 16 today so i got that and the last item that I got was the Estee Lauder Daywear Multi Protection Antioxidant 24 Hour Moisture Cream. <laughs> let, 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 hold on. Cut, try that again. Let's try that again. The last item I got was the Estee Lauder Daywear Multi Protection Antioxidant 24 Hour Moisture Cream Broad Spectrum SPF 15. <laughs> and it was $29.50, and it's normally $59. This is all the 50% off. Comes in a little package like this. And if I open it. Ooh, it's sealed, so that's a good sign. Um, and it's like this really creamy consistency. Look at that. Ooh, it smells like, oh, what does that smell remind me of? It honestly reminds me of this like, kids soap that I used as a kid. I can't put my finger. That should do it for this video. If you enjoyed me overspending in Ulta, make sure you like and subscribe and comment down below what you guys want to see next. I love you guys and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!